the name of Mammoth. He never lied. All the people in the land, even the ones who lived 20 days away, knew about him. The king heard about Mammoth and ordered his subjects to bring him to his palace. Mammoth, is this true that you have never lied? It's true. And you will never lie in your life. I am sure of that. Okay, tell the truth, but be careful. The lie is cunning and it gets on your tongue easily. Several days passed and the king called Mamet once again. There was a big crowd. The king was about to go hunting. The king held his horse by the mane and his left foot was already in the stirrup. Go to my summer palace and tell the queen I will be with her for lunch. Tell, tell her to prepare a big feast. You will have lunch with me then. We won't go, hunt, we won't go hunting and now Mama will lie to the queen. Tomorrow we'll laugh on his behalf. Maybe you should prepare a big feast for lunch tomorrow. And maybe you shouldn't. Maybe the king will come by noon, and maybe he won't. Tell me, will he come or won't he? I don't know whether he put his right foot on the stirrup, or he put his left foot on the ground after I left. Everybody waited for the king. He came the next day and said to the queen, The wise mama, who never lies, lied to you yesterday. But the queen told him about the words of mama, and the king realized but the wise man never lies, and says only that which he saw with his own eyes.